So best friends is um, a term that's banded around a lot these days. And I think that people are a bit careless with its use. If you think about it, when you say something is the best, what you're saying is, is, is number one. Best isn't a plural description of something. It is, you can, there's only one best. When you start calling someone a best friend, they assume that they are number one. So once you start talking about other best friends and you start spending time with them, their, their sense of ownership over that place in your life uh, gets in the way a bit of, of, of your friendship, I suppose. I think it's really born of the overuse of certain words that should really be reserved for when you actually mean them. You know, people will describe things as beautiful far too often. You know, they use love inappropriately, I guess. And the trouble with these terms is they're supposed to be like special terms that you know you only use you know when you really mean it when you start referring to something as best all the time best really starts to mean nothing it's just another word but that is one fantastic thing about university is that this is the first time in my life where I've had more friends than I can count on one hand and on the note of friends here is uh, one of my friends we went out the other night and let's just say if they were gonna make a hangover part three which I really hope they don't. He pretty much wrote the script. So here, here check this out. This is a, uh, this is going to be fun for you. Sometimes I need a trap. This is serious here. Sometimes I need a slow. Yo, we was raised in the dead on this before guns was called pistols. Stapleton was on that hush shit. Live from the New York borough, keeping the dirt with the snakes in the grass. They creeping like squirrels, cause the snitch gonna crack that nut. Don't give a fuck, then. Ten hours long and try to wrap us up. Don't give a fuck, then. Don't give a fuck, then. Don't give a fuck, then. Ten